السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أولا أتمنى أنكم تكون أنتم وأحبابكم بخير وصحة وسلامة معكم زميلتكم من السنة الخامسة ريم عبد الرحمن المهيني إن شاء الله today we'll talk about the oral cavity lecture which is a part of uh, the CNSS block okay so before I start I'd like to say that the oral cavity is one of the digestible lectures in the CNSS block بس إن شاء الله I'll try my best to make it easier for you guys والله يوفقكم يا رب ويزكم على الدرجات So here's the outline I'll start talking about the anatomy and I will move on to common disorders and pathology So the anatomy of the oral cavity you need to know that the oral cavity starts from the lips and it's at the uh, oropharyngeal ethmus or the anterior pillar of tonsils طيب The anterior pillar of tonsils is made of the platyglossial muscle you need to know this okay So what is the, what are the parts of the oral cavity? I will show you have to know that they are seven parts. They start from the lips, buccal mucosa, hard palate, vertebral trigon, the tongue, the anterior two third, the uh, gingiva or gum, the floor of the mouth. Okay. Uh, again, lips, hard palate, vertebral trigon, the anterior two third of the tongue, floor of the mouth. Buccal mucosa and gum. Okay, you need to know that the soft palate and the posterior one third of the tongue are not part of the oral cavity. They are part of the oropharynx. Okay, the soft palate and the posterior one third of the tongue. Okay, so what is the function of the oral cavity? We have speech, mastication, pulse preparation, and initiation of uh, uh deglutition. Okay. Moving on to the lips, as I said, the lips is the external part of the uh, oral cavity. It is made of the orbicularis oris muscle, which is supplied by the uh, facial nerve, okay? Uh, you need to know that the blood supply of the uh, lips is superior lipial and inferior lipial, which is a branch of the facial artery. That is a branch of the extra carotid artery, okay? As for the vein, they have uh, they drain by the facial to orbital عن طريق angular vein. طيب. You need to know the external carotid artery branches as they are very important. First of all, they start from downward to upward. This is the first fact. Then they are named according to the location that they are going to. طيب. So there is a mnemonic. يعني مرة حلو اسمه some anatomist like freaking out poor medical student طيب so you need to know that the first part is the superior thyroid artery then we have the ascending pharyngeal artery the lingual artery the facial artery the um, occipital artery طيب maxillary artery posterior auricular artery and the uh, superficial temporal temporal okay So, uh, what is the nerve innervation of the lips? As any area, we have a motor and a sensory, okay? So, the motor, as I said before, the orbicularis or muscle is supplied by, uh, by the facial nerve, okay? The function of the orbicularis or is closure or blowing of uh, lips, okay? Or mouth. So, uh, the sensory is, is mainly by the trigeminal nerve. البرانشز حقتها اللي هي الانفرا اوربيتال اللي هو عن طريق الماكسيلاري برانش اوف ذا ترايجيمنال اند ذا مينتو ويتش از برانش اوف ذا مانديبلر اللي هو برانش انالسو برانش اوف ذا ترايجيمنال طيب سو واي دو وي نيد تو نو ذيس نيرف انرفيشنز اند سو اون عشان احنا عندنا شيء اسمه كلينيكال كوريليشنز طيب اول وحده ان بيلز بالسي اور فيشل نيرف بالسي اور ذا لوور موتور نيورون ليجن طيب The uh, orbicularis oris will be affected, طيب, as the patient will have a droopy um, lips, as you can see here, and they won't be able to fully close their mouth, and they will have a drooping of the nostril and uh, abnormalities in the uh, orbicularis uh, muscle of the eyes and the uh, frontal part of the forehead, okay? So... Uh, the lower motor neuron lesion طيب, involves both the upper part and the lower part of the face طيب. بينما the upper motor neuron only the lower part of the face the lower motor neuron lesion are ipsilateral يعني 
الرايت هو الرايت فيشل نيرف خربان راح تيجي الليجن بالرايت سايد اوف ذا فيس طيب اما اذا كان ابر موتور نيرون راح تكون كنترولاتر سايد اوكي طيب موفينج uh, اون uh, عندي النيرف المينتال نيرف ديستريبيوشن انا انجري ان ذس اريا ويل ليد مثلا تروما فراكشر او وات ايفر ات از ات ويل ليد تو ابنورمال سنسيشن ان ذس ريجن اوكي يمكن تكون تنجلينج يمكن يمكن تكون نمبنس يمكن تكون بيرنينج وات ايفر ات از طيب موفينج uh, اون uh, عندي الحين التانك طيب التانك از ديفايد انتو رايت اند ليفت سايد Uh, they are divided by the sulcus medianus or the median septum. It has two surfaces, the uh, dorsal and ventral. Okay? They are supplied by the uh, lingual artery, which is a branch of the external carotid artery, and the sublingual artery. Okay. Eventually, they will drain into the uh, facial uh, vein and the internal jugular vein. Okay. As for the lymphatic, they will have uh, the submental and sub submandibular, which are which are part of uh, level one lymph node uh, in the head and neck. طيب. So you need to know here the muscles of the tongue are divided into intrinsic and extrinsic. طيب. So the intrinsic give the shape of the tongue, while extrinsic help movement. طيب. The intrinsic and the superior longitudinal, as you can see in here. The vertical, طيب, and transverse. بني عندي the inferior longitudinal, طيب. The extrinsic عندي the plateau gloss muscle, طيب. عندي gloss, the sylo gloss, the higher gloss, and the gyno gloss, طيب. زي ما تلاحظون كلها نهاية أو شو gloss, 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 طيب. You need to know this fact. All the muscles, طيب, in the Tongue are supplied by the hypoglossal, except one muscle. طيب, the platyglos. Again, all the muscle in the tongue are supplied by the hypoglossal, which is nerve number twelve, except one muscle supplied by vagus, the platyglos. Okay, so uh, moving on, and the, as I said before, the tongue is made of posterior one third and anterior two third. طيب. Each part has a special nerve supply. طيب. The anterior two third is divided into two parts. Part A اللي هي special sensation اللي هي taste. It's carried by the cordis tympani, which is a branch of the facial nerve. As for the um, general sensation اللي هي pain and temperature, they are carried by the lingual nerve. Which is supplied by the trigeminal nerve. Okay, so moving uh, to the posterior one third of the tongue, it is supplied by the glossopharyngeal nerve, both sensory and special. Okay, uh, sensory is the general and special. So, what is the importance of knowing the uh, cord and tympani course? طيب. In a patient who undergoes a cochlear, a cochlear implants or any middle ear related surgery. They might have injury of the cord tympani. If it was unilateral, طيب يعني one side only, uh, one side lesion, the patient will have an, an abnormal or disruption of uh, sensation of taste sensation. طيب. If it was bilateral, the patient will have a severe persistent distressing dryness of the mouth. Okay. So, uh, as a quick recap for the oral cav uh, for the oral cavity, we have seven parts. The oral cavity it it starts from the lips and ends up at the uh, uh, oropharyngeal isthmus. Um, and lips are made by the orbicularis oris, which is supplied by the uh, facial nerve and uh, as from the motor, and the sensory uh, is supplied by trigeminal nerve. The tongue is made of two groups: intrinsic and extrinsic muscle. The extrinsic muscle in here is glass. Uh, all of the muscles are supplied by the um, hypoglossal nerve except one muscle, which is the platyglos muscle. Okay, uh, the sensation and uh, the anterior two third and uh, posterior one third. The anterior two third uh, is supply and uh, special and general sensation. Special are by cord tympani, the branch of facial, and the general is uh, by uh, the um, 
uh, trigeminal nerve, the uh, linguinal uh, nerve, okay? The posterior uh, one-third is supplied by the, uh, the glossopharyngeal nerve, okay? Uh, you need to know that the soft palate and the uh, posterior one-third of the tongue are part of the oropharynx, not the uh, oral cavity. So we have the salivary gland. The gland is on the top or the بينما فيها زي ال ال الباس الباسج يعني راح تفتح في شيء اسمه دكت دكت أو الأورفس طيب فأنا عندي ال براتد دكت أو اسمها ثاني ستينسون دكت راح تفتح بالباكيل ميكوزا طيب لاترال ااا لاترال باكيل ميكوزا at the level of the second molar teeth طيب في شيء مهم بعد عن براتد دكت أنا راح يمر من خلالها وبينها يعني اللي هو facial nerve أول ما يطلع راح يبدأ يعطي ال branches حقتها حقت ال facial nerve طيب اللي هي ال temporal وال zygomatic وال buccal وال mandibular وال cervical أو cervical أوكي then عندي ال sub mandibular طيب زي ما تشوفون هنا هي هي it's أو وارت وارت on duct موجودة بال mid line طيب طبعا هذه أبنا ما هنا فيها stones obstructing the duct normally راح تكون كذا ما تنشاف يعني بهذا الشكل طيب then we have the sublingual duct هي عبارة عن multiple mini ducts بالbulging هذا اللي هو uh, at the floor of the mouth و... و... واسمها الثاني اللي هو ravenous duct طيب so what is the function of the saliva Uh, saliva is very important for uh, immunity as it will give uh, it will produces IgA, uh, peroxidase, and lysosomes, which is which are antibacterial. Then uh, for digestion, it will pr- uh, produces uh, amylase. But lubrication, طيب uh, lubrication مهم لأن it will uh, allow allow the enhancement of the uh, oral hygiene. طيب so if there is a poor uh, lubricant. Uh, or يعني dry mouth it will lead to poor oral ca- oral hygiene طيب طيب اوكي okay, moving on الحين lymphatic drainage اول شيء لازم نعرف احنا ان lymphatic drainage in the uh, head and neck is uh, subdivided into uh, multiple levels طيب these levels uh, احنا we did this classification uh, عشان نعرف the cancer staging and the prognosis of the cancer And to know uh, where do we do the uh, neck dissection, طيب? as well as to know where did the pathology occur exactly. طيب? Uh, for each uh, area has its own special uh, level. طيب? For instance, in the lips, um, it drains into level 1, which is submental and submandibular. The طيب? tongue, عندي مثلا tip of the tongue, it will submental and jugular mohyloid nodes. طيب? وال lateral تروح لل subandibular وال deep cervical nodes طيب فزي ما قلنا عندنا level 1 اللي هو submental subandibular level 2 اللي هو upper يعني upper jugular and the scosal طيب so moving on to the common disorders of the oral cavity the most common one is the oral ulcers طيب oral ulcers عندها various etiologies منها infectious مثل تكون bacterial يمكن تكون fungal يمكن تكون viral okay then we have the autoimmune disorders the traumatic neoplasms uh, and uh, vitamin deficiencies and the list goes on okay so uh, the infectious we have the herpingenia it's caused by co- uh, co- uh, the Coxsackie um, virus uh, it's only uh, most commonly affects children it is uh, a small as you can see here a small multiple vesicles and the uh, mucosa of the uh, mouth a treatment mainly راح يكون supportive طيب um, moving on to the uh, herpetic gingivostomatitis uh, هو عن طريق الherpes uh, simplex virus عندي two type يعني يكون primary يعني يكون secondary طيب ال primary اللي هو زي هذه الحالة اللي عندنا الصورة هذه هذا he is a pediatric طيب um, as you can see here we have vesicles followed by ulcers طيب As for the adult, they will have a recurrent uh, form or recurrent episodes in the uh, verlumin border of the lips. طيب اللي راح يكون اسمها herpes labialis. طيب ليش الأدولت عندهم uh, يعني uh, symptoms هذه uh, إذا صار عندهم reduce uh, للimmunity مثلا كان عندهم uh, stressful event, emotional stress, fatigue, pregnancies or whatever it is, it will be reactivated. ليه لأنها تقول يعني كأنها جالسة بالدرمتوم. طيب. 
البيدياتريك they will have more symptoms مثلا رح يكون عندهم fever, malaise, head, uh, headache uh, uh, sore throat and lymphadenopathies طيب uh, treatment is you could give a uh, cyclovir for uh, a specific patient يعني for a uh, selected patient طيب so we have the candidiasis هو عبارة عن candida albicans infection طيب زي ما انتم شايفينها بالصورة there's two forms يعني انها تكون thrush يعني انها تكون uh, hypertrophic candida طيب thrush كل حالتين راح تجيب هذه الصورة راح يفي زي ال white to grayish patches on top of the tongue طيب or the buccal mucosa كيف فرق بينهم يعني لما أنا I try to whip off this uh, patch إذا كانت thrush راح تروح leaving uh, an arrhythmic tongue or arrhythmic background طيب إذا جيت أحاول أشيلها بالhypertrophic ما راح تروح طيب راح تصير واق موجودة طيب so the treatment إذا كانت عندي thrush أعطيهم topical antifungal إذا كانت hypertrophic أنا لازم أسويهم surgical excision طيب now as for the immune disorders we have the epithelial ulcer and the Behajat disease طيب so the epithelial ulcers are عبارة عن a recurrent uh, superficial painful uh, uh, ulcers طيب زي ما كنت تشوفون هنا عندها زي central halo طيب ممكن تكون بالsoft palate في أي مكان بعد hard palate والgingival طيب ممكن تكون minor ممكن تكون major minor اللي هي most common تكون صغيرة multiple وزي ما قلنا هنا عندها bridge halo فيها necrosis centrally طيب أما الmajor تكون كبيرة طيب وتكون followed by repetitive alterations التريتمنت نعطيهم topical steroid يمكن نعطيهم cauterization and يمكن local pain relief agents طيب البهجة سندروم احنا عندنا ترياد uh, اوفس لايك اوسر ليجن والالسر حقتها مميزة راح تكون الايدجز حقتها بانش داوت طيب راح يكون في جينيتال اوسر اند دي فايروس از يو كان سي هير وي هاف يو فايروس ريكير جينيتال اوسرز اند اوفس لايك ريجن طيب سو از تيك هوم مسج يو نيد تو نو ذات ان اني بيشنت طيب وذ بريزيستنت uh, uh, يعني حتى ديسبايت تريتمنت ما زالت موجودة هذه الليجن طيب وكانت يعني موجودة من فترة طويلة وكان شكلها غريب يعني مو عندها الرجل البوردرز وكذا you have to do biopsy again any persistent lesion or looks suspicious do biopsy وخلصنا المحاضرة هذه والله يوفقكم يا رب ويسهل عليكم